need computer training for a group or office, contact us today to get a free demo of our training at www.teachucomp.com forward slash enterprise dash licensing. You can select to paste a link between two cells so that when the value of the copied cell is changed, the value that is displayed in the linked cell reflects that change. This is very handy when using the result of a formula as the basis for other formulas in linked workbooks or worksheets. For example, if you had a workbook that totaled sales per month on one worksheet, and another worksheet in the same workbook that totaled the monthly sales per quarter, you could copy and link the totals from the first worksheet to the second worksheet. That way, any changes made to the data in the first worksheet would be automatically reflected in the second sheet. To make a link between cells, first copy the cell that you want to link to another worksheet or workbook, and then select the destination cell to link. Then click the Paste Buttons drop-down menu within the Clipboard button group on the Home tab of the ribbon to display the drop-down menu of choices. Select the Paste Link command to paste the link back to the original cell that you copied. Note that if you are using the Paste Special dialog box, you can also click the Paste Link button that appears in the lower left corner of this dialog box to paste a link to the original cell that you copied. Now if you examine the contents of the linked cell, you'll see that it's actually a formula. The formula simply states that this cell's value is to be equal to the value displayed in the copied cell. The cell address shown is the address of the cell that was copied. If you use this feature to paste links between data in separate workbooks, you should exercise care not to rename or move those workbooks. Doing so will break any links in the formula references created by the paste link button forcing you to delete the links and recreate them again, or edit the formula references within each linked cell. As long as you do not move or rename the workbooks, you should be able to change the value in the cell which you copied in one workbook and save your changes. The next time that you open the workbook that contains the linked cells, you may see a small message appear on screen telling you the workbook contains links to data in other workbooks which has changed. To update the values in the linked cells to reflect the changes, click the Update or Enable Content buttons depending on your version of Excel to update the data in the linked worksheet and be sure to save the changes made in this workbook as well. Like what you see? Get a free demo of our training for groups of five or more at www.teachucomp.com forward slash enterprise dash licensing.